Can I ask you one, more, one quick yeah. question on the Haitian migrant issue? Sure. Can you talk a bit more about the need to continue to use Title 42 and why that's so important to this administration? And also, overall, with the Border Patrol, Force Patrols, they've been using those horses for a very long time. Is the, is the Biden administration going to continue to use those horse patrols throughout the rest of the country? I know they're temporarily suspended in Texas, or in Del Rio, Texas, rather. They are temporarily suspended in Del Rio, Texas. I think what Secretary Mayorkas talked about a bit when he was here on Friday is the fact that uh, when these horse patrols are used effectively, um, they often can uh, uh, help people who are in distress. Uh, that's something they do. They can find people. There are There is a reason that these horse patrols have been in place and can and continue to be in place in some parts of, across the country. Of course, our Department of Homeland Security will continue to look at and assess, especially as the investigation concludes, uh, what that looks like. They've been suspended in Del Rio, Texas. Uh, that was a step in response, of course, directly to those horrific photos. Uh, but beyond that, I think it's important to note that, as the Secretary said, the vast majority of the Border Patrol and the Horse Patrol are, are doing their job, and they're doing their job effectively. Of course, we are going to assess and we are going to call out when we see uh, occasions, as we did with the photos and the video last week, that uh, don't meet our bar, that uh, that bring out strong emotions for good reason from people in this, within this administration and around the American public. And when you, you 